But first, we have live team coverage of an ABC 17 Storm Trek weather alert day. ABC 17 Storm Trek chief meteorologist Jessica Hafner is tracking the potential for several inches of snow. Jessica, a winter weather advisory is in effect for parts of mid Missouri. Yeah, that will go till tomorrow night for all of mid Missouri, and that would be for the accumulation of one to three inches of snowfall and gusty winds. That's going to cause a problem on the roads into tomorrow afternoon and evening as those winds could pick up to around 40 miles per hour, causing some visibility issues throughout the evening. And I'm going to be tracking those snow showers as soon as about midnight for our northern counties. Most of us are still above freezing at this time, down into the mid 30s with a couple of of light rain showers around the snowfall still off to our north as low pressure continues to rotate but those snow showers will start to move back in from the north later tonight into tomorrow the winds have been fairly steady today we've seen some gusts up to 30 miles per hour and that will continue into tomorrow and into the afternoon i do think we are going to hold on to gusts around 25 miles per hour going into early Saturday morning. So that could still cause a few is visibility issues into Saturday morning to start off the weekend. Here's our future track tonight at midnight. Those snow showers start to approach northern Missouri and start dropping some accumulation up there. As we approach six or seven o'clock tomorrow morning, snow continues to slowly spread to the south. We are left with some accumulation during the day. You'll see by three or four o'clock, those snow showers start to taper off just a little bit for the evening commute, but the winds will still be around so that'll be an issue especially as the sun goes down so that'll be the main concern going into tomorrow night saturday we are starting off with temperatures in the 20s we could have a couple of slick or slushy spots especially in elevated areas going into saturday morning but overall it's looking like a quieter weekend after tomorrow here's our snow tracker anywhere from one to three inches will be possible there could be a couple spots that get up to four inches especially across northern missouri where we have some of those heavier snow bands and the other thing we'll have to deal with is the wind chill with those gusts up to around 30 or 40 miles per hour during the day tomorrow, it will feel more like 17 in the afternoon. Not much improvement, even though the winds will start to die down a bit on Saturday. It feels like the low 20s for Saturday and Sunday, and then things finally start to improve for next week. The main threat tomorrow will be the wind on top of the snow, of course. Well, blowing snow will be the biggest problem on the road, so it's something we'll be tracking all night into tomorrow morning. The rest of the weekend is going to be cold. I'm not expecting too much more precipitation outside of some flurries on both days with cloud cover next week we warm up and I'm tracking another chance of rain by Tuesday. Road crews in Missouri are preparing for the next round of winter weather. Right now you are taking a live look at a very dark road in Boone County. Our newest team member ABC 17's Megan Drakus joins us live in the storm tracker after talking with Boone County Road and Bridge. And Megan Boone County road crews are fully stocked for this storm. Yes, guys, I'm here on Route 8 tripe of the Columbia Airport right now, and the conditions look pretty dry, actually. Um, it stopped raining, but tomorrow it's going to look a bit different, actually, um, due to the snow and high winds. But when I spoke to today, I'm fully prepared for the storm tomorrow. The only major winter storm we had this year was the ice storm on New Year's Day. And the county has barely touched any of their supplies for the season. The county states that they still have a full winter's worth of materials available, and if needed for the tomorrow's storm, the county has a night crew on call tonight. But caution is always stressed in any type of storm. There may be some impacts during, during the commute home tomorrow from work, and we just ask that you, know, you just take your time and drive according to the conditions, and everybody will get home safe. And Deb and Lucas, crews do want to stress that if you don't have to go out tomorrow, don't stay in. Take a little extra time in the morning um, and be extra careful driving. Reporting live from Boone County, Megan Drakis, ABC 17 News. Okay, thanks, Megan. Welcome to the team. And you can always stay ahead of tonight's experience.